today we're starting our morning without a walk because we slept in. Maybe I'll still go for a walk. It's still beautiful out there. But we don't have any more cups. So we have resulted to the whatever these are. I don't know if they're wine glasses. We don't drink, so we don't know. We've got some apple juice. We've got our lovely waffle with some je jelly on it and some bacon. And he has the same. We're going to sit here and enjoy our view and decide if we're going to go for a walk. Or not. So there's a chance of rain and thunder here in the next 10 minutes or so. But we're just going to see how it goes. It only lasts for like 10 minutes. Oh, I feel the rain. You feel the rain? And then it's supposed to clear back up until like this evening, which is fine. And then it's supposed to rain all afternoon, all evening, I guess. So we're just gonna, as long as there's not thunder, we'll be in the water because it's well, still like lightning. 85 degrees. Yeah, lightning. We don't want lightning, I understand. So we're just gonna see how it goes. Okay, can you see Jason out there? Right there. He's having a great time in these waves. <laughs> Did you have, you have fun? Yeah, had a few waves this time. Good. Now it's a uh, pouring rain, sideways rain. Got the umbrella up to keep me dry. Usually it's to keep the sun out. If you're in the water, you can't tell. I know, I'm just kind of done being in the ocean. Okay. You wanna <laughs> go back and play in the pool? Yeah, if it lets up. We'll get cleaned up and leave here. All right, you guys. <laughs> we didn't really film coming home from the beach because it started pouring rain. We dealt with the rain for quite a while. Uh, just because we were in the water and it doesn't really matter, but it was pouring rain and It got to the point where not even my umbrella could keep me dry and he was just playing I wish I had brought my GoPro I probably would have gotten in more with him if I had had my GoPro because he the what the waves were kind of getting bigger um, And so he was having a lot of fun in the water But um, it really hurt to wear my swimsuit and have the straps right where my sunburn is and so I was getting really uncomfortable. And then I like had a, t a uh, tank top on over my sweatshirt so I didn't get any more sunburned on my back because it hurt to put any sunscreen on it. And so I just got to the point where it was bugging me so much, but we came home, we had sand in crevices. <laughs> it took us a long time to get cleaned up and now I'm all cleaned up. The skies are still, well you can't, yeah you can. They're still really murky. It's still 86 degrees out there. It's still really hot and humid. Um, but it is not go sit by the pool weather like I had hoped. I had hoped to like sit in the sun for a little bit longer. I would have just worn a tank top to cover my, the back of my, my back. But we are gonna go and get food for now. And then I think within this video, we will reveal our second secret. <laughs> Should we? Take a guess right now what you think the secret is. Because I don't think I'm going to include it in the thumbnail. I don't think I'm going to give it away in the thumbnail. No, don't give it away. No. You have to guess our secret. Okay. We're going to go get food first. Also, I was um, FaceTiming or doing a Zoom call with my family. My dad, we have a conference for church twice a year. And everyone, every year we've liked to kind of get together and chat about it and zoom has made that easier I'm trying to look and see if i have everything um so only about half of us were on the calls for the those of us who are living far away my dad's in or my brother's in north carolina my sister is just about an hour and a half south of my dad and my other sister was driving home to her house and so none of us were actually at my dad's house and everyone who was supposed to be at my dad's house was late and so I was like I gotta go and eat I can't stay in the call waiting for everyone else to show up and talk about all that you wanted to talk about I gotta go I gotta eat and be in Hawaii Plus we so didn't watch it so yeah we didn't watch it because we were here so anyway I'll watch it when I get home but now it is time to go and eat okay Jason's out trying to be like I'm trying to be lovey-dovey and give you a hug and he's like wrapping his arm around my sunburned back and my shoulder and gripping my shoulder I know I know tough love tough love tough love very odd to see the gray skies and the rain we never seen and not like this here. Yeah. and not think it's 60 degrees outside and then to step out of your car and you're immediately like I'm hot <laughs> yeah yeah it's, it's like 80 warm. something degrees it's warm. it's warm okay I don't know where it cut off um, I ran out of space on that disc. I have, luckily I have eight gigs left. And 
I'm gonna need every bit of that for our surprise. So we're just walking through Lahaina and trying to decide what we go and eat. We haven't done, what haven't we done? Oh. So we haven't done Cool Cats and we haven't done Chemos. But I think Cool Cats is Mexican. I don't think I can do that. So we're gonna go check. All right, so while we are creatures of habit and went to Cool Cats again, I was mistaken. We'd eaten the Cool Cats before. We had not eaten at Down the Hatch, which is down below Cool Cats. But we did get something different this time, correct? Oh yeah, it was a good way to go. We got the grilled chicken good. plate that had pineapple on top, teriyaki sauce, and, well, I guess it was grilled with teriyaki. And then our side was a salad. And then we got a basket of fries, which we both enjoyed. Because well, we split it. So yeah, it and we split all of that. No, I don't feel like I'm just bloated and like, yeah. Yeah, so, so yeah. And it's hard to like not keep looking for souvenirs. That was really cute. I still haven't found a sweatshirt for this time. But I think they need to be in larger sizes. That one's kind of cute. I actually kind of like this one right here. Ooh, that's a nice weight too. Yeah, that one's like lightweight. Okay, let's go try and look for that one real quick. We're just killing time before our next surprise. surprise. Okay, we're just out here shopping. I did buy a sweatshirt. It's in my bag here. I have to show you a little souvenir haul when we're done. But Ashley just texted me this photo and it said that she popped her tooth out with a Nerf gun. <laughs> she lost the tooth the day before we left. And now she's popped another one out. So Jason's checking, like, did she really pop it out with a Nerf gun? So, crazy kids. Meanwhile, it's still a gray, murky, rainy day here in Lahaina. All right, we are across from the Hotel Lahaina. It's right there. And we're headed toward our surprise. If you know this area, maybe you know what I'm walking up toward. Getting a tattoo. This is not an impulse thing. Like, this is it's not, not like we just came up with it no. on this trip. I thought about getting it when we were on the Big Island earlier this year. Didn't like the feel of the Big Island in was general. You, were you thinking about it even before then? Yeah, I was thinking yeah. about it before yeah. then. I've been thinking about this for like a year and a half. And I thought about it. I've designed it. I have put a deposit down for it. We have an appointment in about five minutes. And I'm going to do it. And I think part of why I'm nervous is it's it's new. It's, it's taboo, I guess, with our religion to have tattoos. Not after today, though. No, <laughs> stop. <laughs> it's not officially okay after uh, today. Okay. But anyway, um, not every one of my friends and family are going to agree with my decision to get this. But that's okay. It's my decision to get one. And now you just get to wait and see what it's going to look like. I don't know. What do you think about me getting it? I I was surprised when you said it. Like it feels like forever ago. Yeah. And I was like, well, if you want to, you know, if you yeah. thought about it, and your whole idea of what it's going to look like, I think is great. Yeah. Gonna keep the camera on me. Oh, sorry. Um, I think it's going to look great. Uh, There's a lot of meaning, meaning behind, behind, it. behind it. I think we might have to get creative on how because you've been talking with the uh, yeah. artist. I've been talking with the artist on how to design it and how big it can be and yeah. And so what colors and stuff. If this is what you want to do, I support you. I think it'll be, it'll be cute, it'll be yeah. sexy. He's joking around and saying that he's going to tell my brothers that he has oh. one, but it's only viewable for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's not getting one. No, no, I can never think of what I want. You've thought of something that has a lot yeah, of Yeah, this is pretty, cool, this is pretty, it's not unique by any means, but something but, I'm well, doing with it, it is unique. It's something to you, and yeah. so that's what matters. And It wouldn't fit with him doing it at all. No, no, I'm not gonna put that on me, but... Uh, no, it wouldn't fit. If I could think of something... About, I, even in high school, I was like, oh, I want something, but I could never... The whole think life, I've never thought of what I would want and where and all that, so uh, maybe someday. Guys, it is so humid. It is. Let's go, let's let's, go get let's the go surprise in. done. In heart, take me far away. I think you'll like the final one. The 
does it feel like? Lots of pinprick. You're doing good, huh? You like it? Yeah. I like it. All right, all right. <laughs> so painful. They're, but it looks good, so right? Close to me, yeah. It looks so good. Yeah, I love it. Not what I expected at all, but better. Nice. Yeah, nice. it was quite the experience. We had a hard time to start with, but once she started actually doing it, then it was fun. Yeah, it looks amazing. I think. You I think like it looks. It? I think it looks great. The kids think it looks great yeah, too. Yeah, kids like it. We've sent them text messages. <laughs> this was quite the process for me, um, and I'm quite tired and I'm kind of shaky. All so right, just, let's yeah. go. The battery's dying too. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Okay, we're back at home. Horrible lighting. It's almost nine o'clock at night. I'm absolutely in love with my little tattoo. So cute. Um, it's exactly where I wanted it to be. And it's the size, everything I think. It's a little bit here. bigger than I wanted it to be. I wanted it to be smaller, but everyone told me you won't get the color that you want and make it realistic if you don't make it a little bit bigger. So I get it now. It is really, really nice and very realistic. Um, we are here at our little unit. We have lots of leftover fish. We did not anticipate getting that many fish. This is like how many we got per serving. And so we basically ate one serving for both of us. And so we have a whole nother serving left over. These are the fries left over from Cool Cats today. And then this is a crab cake wonton from, um, where was this one at? This one was from Hula Grill. So you're just gonna bake that up and we are having to pack. We leave tomorrow morning. If you are thinking about getting a tattoo in the future, um, make sure you get it on your last day or your last evening before you leave um, because you cannot swim with it. You cannot submerge it. So make sure you've showered and shaved and done all the things. I have to, I'll maybe follow the process in other videos as we go home. I have to leave a little plastic wrap on it for three to five days and then I can take it off. So it actually is gonna look a little gnarly for a couple days, she said. Kinda gets pussy and bloody underneath the little plastic. Um, but then it'll clear up when I peel it off and wash it off, so. Quite the experience. I'm happy that I did it and I'm happy I did it in Hawaii because Hawaii does mean so much to me. Leave a comment down below if you've ever had a tattoo, if you ever have thought about getting one, and if you ever wanna get one in Hawaii because if you are a Hawaii lover like me, and I know a lot of you came to my channel because of Hawaii, so I know that a lot of you understand. So leave a comment below if you have one or if you've ever wanted to get one, and let me know what kind you would want to get, like what, what design. Is, yeah. He doesn't know what, what he would ever get. So I, I, I've never found one that had yeah. enough meaning to justify getting it. So yeah. maybe someday. Maybe. 
All right, you guys, we got a lot to clean up and pack. We got more waffles for breakfast tomorrow morning because we still have strawberry jam. <laughs> Take care. Join us tomorrow. We have a little bit of time in the morning. We're going to see what we have time for um, before we head home. But one more Maui vlog for you guys. So stick around. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Mahalo.